Alright, I'm back. I have hooked up the Blue Yeti microphone. Um, and it's saying I am live. There we go. I'm live. I'm seeing it on on the YouTube screen. Uh, there might be a little delay here, so, you know, just kind of bear with me. This microphone is actually really cool. Um, I can make this... If I switch the gain here and up the gain, and I'm saying gain, not game, gain, G-A-I-N, in the headphones it becomes louder. I don't know if that means it's going to be louder to the listeners or watchers or whatever. Um, and then it's pretty cool. Uh, if I switch this knob, it does a bunch of different like angles. Um, yeah, so this one, so depending on your, the placement of where you're speaking, it will pick up, like if I go here, you won't hear me, but if I go here, you'll hear me, which I think is, it's like, like different directional microphones almost, like more, mul multiple microphones in one, and then if I go here, you don't hear me. But if I'm here and I go like this, you can hear me. Interesting, right? That's pretty freaking cool. They're... I don't want to say channels, but... Um, I forget what they call them. I think it's... Condensers. Uh, that's the last one, right? Yeah. But I'm partial to this one. Right? Is that the one? Yes. Right? Uh, nope. Uh, yeah, that one. I'm partial to this one, which is uh, called cardio cardioid. Um, I think it's. I think you get a better you get better sound quality out of this one because you're like right in front of it almost, like almost right in front of the mic. So um, so yeah. The headphones are really cool. Um, the audio comes through perfectly. So now, uh, one thing I wanted to point out, which I didn't get to do yet um, in the last live stream, because my mom called me. That's awkward, right? Um, <coughs> so, oh, it says somebody's watching me. Who's watching me? It's probably me. I did that before uh, on Twitch the other day when I was watching for the first time. Um... Yeah, so one thing I wanted to point out regarding the the, the headset, um, the Xbox headset is, if you go, let me show you, if you if you plug something in here. Now I just found this out yesterday. I didn't know this, and I never thought of, never thought anything of it, but apparently, if you have like an adapter or splitter or whatnot, then you need, I don't, you can't really see it, but if you look closely on here, there's three white like rings around the, the two, the, the male in, uh, input. Apparently that makes a difference. Um, especially with Xbox one, they say, um, I haven't tried it without it, so I don't know if that's, like, a legit thing. Um, I bought this, uh, also with the headphones, uh, with the, with the mic and the headphones from, uh, Amazon for, I think it was, like, seven bucks. It comes, it's a splitter, headphone, microphone. Um, I thought it was really interesting that those rings would make a difference. Um, in all the years that I've been interested in, uh, whether it be audio or or video, who the hell knew that that makes a difference? Um, that could explain why a lot of the stuff that I used was like shit quality. Interesting, right? Weird. Um, so let's see. 
uh, now that we have everything set up and uh, and we got the unboxing out of the way, um, shoot me comments, guys. Like, shoot me comments. Let me know what you think of the audio compared to this crappy webcam that I had from like eight years ago. I would say probably. Um, and let me know. You know. Let me know what you know what you think and what you think of the sound quality and what you think of my live stream. You know, am I entertaining? Am I boring? Uh, what do you want to see more of? What do you want to see less of? Um, should I not be doing this? Do I suck at life? Um, I mean, I probably do suck at life right now, but whatever. <clears throat> um, yeah, let me know what you want, what you guys want to talk about. This whole like live streaming thing actually opens an entire new world to me. Um, I had started a podcast about, <coughs> I would say maybe two years ago. I did two episodes. Um, I found it to be a lot of work. It was like you're you're recording and uh, and then you're editing and you know you gotta get try to get people to to, to comment and and be on your show and. Ain't nobody got time for that shit. So this actually opened an entire new world to me. Uh, <coughs> uh, sorry. Um, as far as just discussing things I like. Um, that includes like shows like Arrow, Flash. The whole CW Arrowverse um, is pretty remarkable to me. It has, in my opinion, it's totally revolutionized television. Um, you're liter you literally have, uh, was it five shows now? Flash, Supergirl, Arrow, uh, Legends, yeah, uh, yeah, four shows. Flash, Arrow, Supergirl, Legends, yeah. You have four shows that all exist in the same universe. Now, Supergirl didn't, but it did, which is weird. It kind of... I'm totally digressing from anything I started here. Either way, um... I guess the whole point of this live stream is just to... Give... Everyone an idea of, of who the hell I am and what I do. You know, like... Why the hell do you people want to watch me? My... You know, what do I do? Who am I? Who's this weird guy in front of me? Um... Sorry, I'm just kind of getting used to this whole thing. I'm trying to build my online presence. Um, yeah, this, 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 I don't have to do my podcast anymore. I can literally just live stream. I can sit here with, with my friend Sal, who, um, who's a good, you know, good friend of mine that we, you know, we started the, we did the first episode of my podcast together, um. It was a lot of fun. The initial, the initial title of the podcast was um, "Shooting the Shit with Two Dicks," because it literally came about from us just sitting around shooting the shit, and and, and developed into into a podcast and. Um, yeah, so he, you know, when we were trying to come up with names, he was like, "What about just shooting the shit with two dicks?" And I'm like, "No, I'm like, I don't know, I don't know if I like that. Maybe that's what this will turn into. I don't know. Well, what the hell do I know? Um, all I know is I'm out here to have a lot of fun. I'm out here to build an online presence. Um, uh, I got my cat here. I'm sorry. She's she's begging for some attention." Um, I have two cats. Uh, yeah. Um, so, the Blue Yeti microphone. Uh, I like it. I like the, he the headphones are, let me tell you about the headphones, okay? The headphones are loud. They're noise canceling. I don't hear anything in the background except for what this mic is picking up, which is awesome. And unfortunately, you might kind of get that sometimes too because I do. Um, I have my office 
<clears throat> set up in my kitchen, which is weird. Um, and the reason why I did that is because I literally never use my kitchen for anything other than just like hanging out and, and uh, you know, drinking a couple brews and, and all that nonsense. Um, I literally never used it to host anybody or whatever. So I finally, I got to the point, I'm like, I, I kind of want like a little office and the, the, the desk that I had just kind of wasn't cutting it for me anymore. So I was like, you know what? And I said, I got this big ass kitchen. I said, I had fish tanks in here. Um, I'm also a fish hobbyist. Uh, I have, I'm currently up to two tanks. At one point I had five. I recently got rid of a 220 gallon fish tank um, for retardedly cheap because it was cracked. It had a bunch of chips on the side. What are you doing? Stop it. Sorry. Um, yeah, the tank was cracked and uh, I wasn't really, I, it had been sitting outside for like months and my landlord was just giving me a bunch of shit for it. So I was like, you know what, whoever wants it, come and take it. Offer me whatever you want. And that's it. Um, yeah. Uh, I, I'm, I'm, I'd like to think of myself as a multifaceted person. Um, I, do a lot, I do a little bit of everything. And a lot of nothing. Uh, not my proudest admission. Um, but yeah. I, you know. I'm, I'm just here to. I'm here to have fun. I don't know if anybody would even want to watch me or you know maybe maybe let's see i got some something going on on uh on twitter here if you guys see me on twitter <coughs> or you see an announcement on twitter you know join me man you know we don't have to do anything we don't have to you know not every stream has to be something in particular it could just be hey i'm bored and i'm going going live you know, um, eventually I'm going to go live, uh, doing other things, you know, I'm going to, uh, be on, on Twitch, um, be on Twitch, I'll be on YouTube eventually, streaming video games, I have to get a video capture card, that's going to take a while, that is expensive. Expensive, and I have to make sure that my computer specs are going to meet the demands of the card. Uh, the more I look into this, the more the shit gets more and more complicated. It's not the end of the world. It's just going to slow things down a little. I, I like to dive headfirst into things. I, I, don't, I don't play around. I like to... If I have an idea, I'm going to go out. I'm going to buy the equipment. I'm going to buy what I need. And... You know what, if it doesn't work and I, if it doesn't work and I don't do anything with it, then hey, I have the equipment if I ever want to do it again. You know, um it's an ever changing world. Um So yeah, I don't know much of like much about streaming. If you guys wanna shoot me an email, feel free to. Um the Kev ten forty two T H E kev1042 at gmail.com you can also follow me on twitter also the kev1042 uh now, you're probably sitting there going oh why the hell is your youtube your your twitter handle the kev because there's only one of me okay i'm gonna throw that out there and it's gonna be for the entire freaking world to see there's only one of me I will make you laugh. I will make you cry. I will probably make you angry. You'll probably want to rip my eyes out. But there is only one of me. So I am the Kev1042. Thank you. Um, listen, I don't know if anybody's going to be interested in this. Totally like out of my element here. I hope to be entertaining. If I'm not like... If I'm not entertaining or whatnot, don't be a dick, you know? Just don't, don't be like, hey, you'll kill yourself or anything like that. I'm not a kid. I'm not going to get, like, all butthurt over nonsense. I'm just going to ignore your ass, and that's going to be the end of it. You're not going to get a rise out of me. I shouldn't say that because 
that might y'all might try to challenge me on that and i don't know how i feel about that i don't want to be challenged um bottom line is i'm just looking to have fun um and you guys can have fun with me you know we'll make each other laugh i'm sure i'm i'm a wild dude and i hope i hope you guys will appreciate that. Again, if you guys want to shoot me an email, give me any ideas, tips, uh, equipment tips, um, anything else you want me to review, I'm actually gonna re I'll review my the the new webcam tomorrow when it comes. <coughs> I'll do an unboxing video and then um, probably do it live. I kind of like this live thing. If this works the way I'm hoping. Uh, in which case it'll, it'll save the live stream once I'm done and then you all can go back and watch it. Um, then I'll do the live stream. I also have an idea. Um, my friend Sal started his own, uh, art company called Cultivated Clout. Um, Cultivated Clout Unlimited. <clears throat> and, uh, <clears throat> he's a graffiti artist and he's really good at what he does. And, uh, he had talked about wanting to do some live, you know, live shit too. So, if, if y'all are interested in some of that or whatever, uh, hashtag graffiti porn, um, shoot me an email. I'm sure we'll, we'll definitely, we'll, we'll be on here doing, doing some of that stuff. It might be under his, uh, the, uh, Cultivated Clout, uh, YouTube name. It all works the same way, so, you know, we'll have a little fun with it. You know, you watch him do a, you know, draw some stuff. The kid's incredible. I'm not going to, you know, he's good at what he does. Uh, if you're interested in purchasing any of his uh, products or something that you see live streamed or, or whatnot, uh, you can shoot him an email, cultivatedclout at gmail.com. Um, his stuff is also available for purchase at cultivated clout dot big cartel dot com uh, that's you can find his stuff there if you have any requests you want your name done in graffiti you want a you know New York City skyline done in graffiti um, and I'm not talking like you know he's not gonna go out and do it on a wall or anything like that it's canvases stickers um, paper, whatever, whatever you guys want, uh, shoot them an email, and, you know, we're all about cross-promotion here, you know, like, we're all, we're all trying to do the same thing, we're all trying to go out there and make names for ourselves and become popular and, you know, hope to win you over, um, that's my, my kitties, sorry, um, aren't they cute, they're cute, right, I know, you don't have to tell me, I know, I know my cats are cute, I pick out good cats, um, so, yeah, this thing's counting down again. We're at two minutes and 50 seconds. I don't know if this is, like, worth doing, you know, worth anything. I don't know if anybody, I doubt any, anybody's even going to watch this. Maybe you will. You know, we'll see. I think I have a, a decent online presence. Um, maybe we'll try to go live on Instagram and see how that works. Um, yeah, like I said, you know, I'll, I'll keep doing product reviews and, uh, product reviews, product, yeah, product, right, yeah, product reviews, um, I want to start reviewing some video games as well, um, I'm really interested in trying WWE 2K18, uh, the videos that I've seen from it. I've not been impressed. <clears throat> I'm actually rather annoyed with the fact that the graphics look so cartoony. Um, I don't know why that is. It shouldn't be. We're in an age where you know you have games like Assassin's Creed and Grand Theft Auto and and Mafia Three, uh, like realistic as hell. And then you got a game like like that, and then even better, <clears throat> even better, is you have a game like NBA 2K18. That game is mad realistic, okay? 
why is 2K18 still looking like 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 a Sega Genesis like Sega Genesis or or, or like a Nintendo 64 or like Raw versus SmackDown? Like I've played all those games. Those games had great graphics for its time. It's time to move up in the world, you know? Like <clears throat> these these characters shouldn't look cartoony. They should look realistic. I should be looking at <clears throat> Roman Reigns as if he were Roman Reigns in person. Don't hate on Roman Reigns. Okay? I don't want to hear it. I don't understand the hate. He's not bad. He's a shitty wrestler. But whatever. Anyway, I digress. Again. Um, I want to also review the new Call of Duty. I know there's tons of reviews out there. Listen, I'm going to do a lot of shit that everyone's done already. Okay? I'm just going to like let you know that. I'm going to do that. It's going to happen. Um, but I'm going to do it because I want to. I think I'm going to lose this stream in five seconds. So if you're watching, enjoy. Thank you. Uh, oh, okay. It's still going. Right? Weird. I don't get that. Then why'd you count down on me? Anyway, sorry. <clears throat> I guess I can continue then. Um, <clears throat> let's see. I don't know if there's anything else I want to talk about. Uh, I guess we'll talk about Arrow. Since that's also one of my one of my big my big things, <clears throat> uh, we're on winter break right now with Arrow. It had its season six mid season finale last uh, last week. <clears throat> um, I'm trying to I'm trying to remember. What was it? Last week was um it was. Kind of a long, long week for me. <clears throat> I'm not going to go into details. I mean, if you really want me to, shoot me an email. Thekev1042 at gmail.com. <clears throat> I'll explain it. But I'm, I'm kind of... Everything's kind of been a blur for the last week. Um, but, I mean, for the most part, yeah. I mean, I, I, it, Arrow was really good. <clears throat> it's always pretty good. Um... Uh, Supergirl, we got to see, uh, Rain at the end of the, uh, mid-season finale. We got to see Rain, um, apparently she's, that's my refrigerator. That's what I was talking about. I don't know why it does that. I don't know why it's gotta be so loud and I don't know how to, um, apparently the pop filter that I bought, that I had for my other setup, <clears throat> that pop filter doesn't work, um, doesn't clip on to the, this, handle this setup here <clears throat> which means i have to purchase yet another pop filter um i'm not rushing to do that so that's no big deal um uh yeah so we got to see rain which was pretty cool um i'm not digging the whole like monel thing i'm not i'm not liking it i think he's gonna end up Unless they make him a series regular, there was no point in bringing him back. <clears throat> um, we we just got word today through the interweb that Colton Haynes is returning to Arrow. Uh, I'm assuming that's going to be on a either full time or semi full time basis. Oh, that's right, that's right. My memory just kicked in. Uh, uh, mid season finale, Arrow. Um, the team, Team Arrow, was, like, like, destroyed. No, uh, um, Renee ratted on, on Oliver. So he's off the damn team. Dinah left because Oliver accused her of, I like, you know, kind of betraying them. Um, Curtis left because he couldn't deal with the fact that Oliver had them tailed. Um... Yeah, man, like, there's no, there's no Oliver. I mean, not Oliver. There's no, there's no Team Arrow. <clears throat> uh, that's, that's crazy to me. That was wild. That's, that is on par with the mid-season finale of 
season three when Oliver goes up against uh, Ra's al Ghul. Um, and he kicks him off a freaking mountain after stabbing him twice. Like, like for real? Like, Oliver Queen is dead? No, that don't happen, right? Otherwise, there's no show. Um, Legends, also good. We, we said uh, goodbye to Jax, which was very, very, very sad. Um, as any uh, Legends of Tomorrow fans know, uh, and if you don't know, stop watching. Um, do not watch any further because I'm going to talk about the show from uh, the Crisis on Earth X. <clears throat> um, and if you don't want to know, go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. <clears throat> now that the spoiler warning is out of the way, if you're still here, that's on you. Uh, on uh, Crisis on Earth X, Martin Stein uh, died. After being shot twice, saving everybody on uh, on Earth X, um, and he he freed Jack.